Hey guys, it's Anne over at Plan Obsessed, and we're going to take a look in on the three bins that I started all at the same time with the offspring from my Titans project. So these are European night crawlers. So let's have a look and see what they're doing and feed them up. Okay, so let's have a look and see what they're doing. Let's go look at this one. Pull back the bubble wrap and see what we've got going on. Well, it looks like I've managed to catch some fruit flies. <laughs> Great. First it was springtails, now it's fruit flies. Excellent. All right, got a little sprout of... Wow, that's a whole lot of something. Let's see what these little guys are doing here besides collecting fruit flies. It did have the bubble wrap on there, so it did stay decently moist. Oh, good. Our friends the springtails are still here. What is in there? Okay, I'm going to start flipping it. Let's see what we get. Looks like I've got some potato peelings still. Oops. Some coffee. Paper bedding. Avocado shell. Well, we didn't catch it in time for a worm ball. It's been a couple weeks, so. Oh, it looks like the potato peel is trying to sprout. Okay. Well, I think it's going to benefit from the very wet feeding that I have for it today. Let's go over and look at the other one, or the next one. Okay. You can see that there is a good, good size worms. Looks like we've got a little worm ball here. I don't know what they're all attached to. Coffee filter. Still with the springtails over here. I don't I don't know what's going on with that. I don't really have them in my other bins. But the same bins that had them before, they're back here in the same spot again. I don't know, maybe it's location, location, location. Well, it certainly looks like even though there's a little scraps of food here and there, they're going to need that food. There's a lot of worms in here. Looks like they're doing just fine reproducing. Okay. And bin number three. Peel back the, the bedding and see what we get. Well, that is a good size worm ball. Definitely. This is, must have been more worms in here than there was in the other ones. It seems to be quite a bit farther along with the potato peelings trying to grow. But it looks like the castings are a little farther along in this one. Well, we've got them all fluffed up here and had a good look at them and I think they could do with a good amount of food. Okay, so let me set you up and then we'll feed them up. Okay, Let's start by getting all the leftovers in the back there.
All right, so I'm gonna give them a good feeding right there. Okay. So I'm gonna give them a decent size feeding of coffee filters and coffee oranges and whatever else is in there. And then I'm gonna cover that up with the existing bedding so that we don't attract any more creatures. And then cover this up with the bubble wrap. And we'll move okay. over to the next one. Do the same thing over here. Just move everything up this way. Put the leftovers in the back. give them a good feeding. <clears throat> okay, same sort of thing. Coffee filters. Got some lemons in here. And then we're going to cover it up. And say goodnight to these little ones. story. And then find them a feeding. Okay. Same stuff. Give them some lemons, coffee, a little bit of expired tapioca pudding. They should be more than thrilled with. Cover them up. Get them their bubble wrap. Alright guys, give me a muddy thumbs up if you like the video. Click subscribe if you're not already a member of my worm family. And if you want to know what I'm doing, when I'm doing it, ring that little bell icon. Alright guys, well thanks for hanging out with me and my worms, and everybody have a good day.